Now the you this one. Welcome back then, ladies and gentlemen. We're getting ourselves ready for the A final gear at the car side training team in the evening round number four. And the first is looking to meet season one forward now with Zach Sweeney. Starting to beat five on the grid, maybe a better result in the heat. The same as on Paul with Jay in second place there, joining him on the front row. Then he comes Luca there in third place, JP for myself in fifth. Behind me then comes uh, <clears throat> Jacob there in sixth. Jack Willis in P7, the Blue Hedge P8, then Ollie rounding off the grid there in ninth place. We're getting ourselves ready, lining up on the grid. All nine cars here, ready for the marshal <coughs> to signify the start of the race. I'm on the line! Whatever. Chat. Waiting for him to drop the flag, and then we're underway here for the final. Here we go then, the flag's up, the flag's down, and we're running away and racing here for the car track race of Super League. But immediately it's up to myself. to miss it. I'm talking to the camera. And the tyre barrier is a fantastic drop from Marshall there. To get that tyre barrier fixed in good time. Ollie seems to be okay. He's still in the car. And feeling in spit and span okay, condition. Huh? No. Oh. You be careful. <clears throat> but yeah, fantastic job. Ollie seems to be okay. Talking with the marshals about what happened, what the incident was that caused it. And um, hopefully we can get ourselves back underway in racing in absolutely no time whatsoever. Looking on board with our race leader there of Seamus. Our pole sitter got a fantastic start, was able to lead off the first lap. Jay unfortunately unable to make any headway. Luca there, still in P3. Myself managed to make up a couple of places. Joe unfortunately falling back a couple there, but unfortunately it doesn't matter at all. We only completed one lap of the race and so forth. We're going to go for a full restart. That means everyone going to be back in their original good places. Full restart, there we've been cleared up off the circuit. We got ourselves ready. We are back to the grid job. I don't even know if Drew's going to keep this in the video for us. If he does, fantastic, thanks for watching. If he doesn't, Drew, you're a knob. Uh, for making me talk and fill through this red flag here. It's fantastic. Very, very nice of you indeed. I'm just talking to myself. I look like an absolute oh. lunatic. Uh, this is if I'm completely honest. <clears throat> it gets some like uh, halfway time, halfway show uh, music. So uh, yeah, looking back on the rest of the grid. You see Jack give us a bit of a wave. Got Joe there. Got Jay Gibbley and Holly up there on the barrier. Marshall still talking to him, discussing what's going on. And then we can get ourselves back on the way. And there's a little was a really, really big crash. A massive one. That's not something you often see uh, here at Crash Road Kramer. The tires all over the circuit. First time here. Uh, first time I've seen it. I've been here seven years since I was nine years old. Uh, and I'm now 16. I started back in 2015. It is now 2022, which I'm sure you're all aware back at home. <clears throat> Hopefully. Uh, we can avoid a similar incident in the next part of this race. The next restart, the next part two of the A final. And we'll go back to the grid in just a moment. Unfortunately, it is live, I'm talking live, so time to start ourselves back through. Onto the grid there, 
and just behind him, Joe. Well, if you the good order once more, it's Seamus on pole with Jay alongside. He'll join him on the front row there in second place. Then comes Luca and Joe ran off the second row in third and fourth. Myself in P5 with Jacob just behind me there in fifth place. Then comes Jack. Uh, they're running off row number three in sixth place. Louis Head uh, in seventh uh, with Holly running off the grid there uh, in P8 and 9. Hopefully we can get off to a pretty clean start here today. Still waiting for Oli to rejoin us back at the uh, starting blocks. And we can get ourselves back on the way and racing. The green flag running. The round number four, the A final. The car check from the Junior League 2022 season. <clears throat> Hopefully you can get off to a similar good start. Try and follow Luca through off lap one. Get a good launch and absolutely fly here today. <clears throat> Holly now joining us, he's going to join round uh, and round off at the back of the grid there in ninth place. Just talk to the good order once more. It is Seamus Cox on pole position, joined by there by Jaden in second place. Luca and Joe round off the second row there in third and fourth, myself in P5. Jacob rounds off there in P6 with Jack Willis in P7. Louis Hedge and Holly round off in eighth and ninth, respectfully. They'll round off at the back of the grid. Only way is up for those two at the back. Louis Hedge, a renowned YouTuber again. Hedgehog Motorsport, he knows his way around the racetrack and he certainly knows his way forward in this Grand Prix today. <clears throat> you can see there, Jaden, with some fantastic tyre warming skills, we're going to copy soon and get those tyres warmed up. <clears throat> and once again, find the checks by the marshal. Just to make sure everyone's in their grid slot, not doing anything illegal. <clears throat> and here we go. Pass it from Ray Fonda, flags up, the flags down, we're underway and racing here, Jacob getting a fantastic launch, we're already up our inside and trying to move inside our position.
Dan Luca. And unfortunately, a bit of a nod of the head there to Marcus, uh, who has to put up with my absolute shocking driving there, unfortunately. But well done. Has to be our drop round. That is a poor result for myself. But onwards and upwards for the rest of the season. It's not over until it's over. As James is on an absolute world of form. And very well done to him. And we're unfortunately. I just got mugged off. <laughs> <laughs> Who? So I just got mugged off by everyone.